powder on my chest is not drugs. It's baby powder I put there to keep me cool and fresh. Oh God, all you. My show, my show go had to come back. September 27, 26, 9 p.m. If I get out, I want to surrender to TV sex. One is one. One is one. Oh God, oh God. Seven forty-five in Trinidad and Tobago. Well, uh, this is the end of this program as I know it because our very own Philomena Alexis Batiste, or Philo as uh, she is affectionately known, is at it again. As a single parent of five, she is constantly in search of ways to move forward in life in order to provide for her children and support their dreams and aspirations. Of course, she is law-abiding, so all her endeavors must be legal since she understands the importance of setting the right example. On her journey forward, however, life throws her many challenges, especially like the Prime Minister calling you while you're sitting on the toilet. But how does she deal with them? Well, you know, fellow, she is determined to hold it down. Here's a clip from Philo's traumatic experience of being robbed. That's from her new series. Unfortunately, we're not getting the, 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 the audio for this, uh, which, which is not an attempt to, to set her up, uh, but, but Philo, What's the story? I, I, what was with the handcuffs? Well, good morning, everybody. Good morning. I just want to say thank you to WPC Bennett who bring me here this morning. She's the one who had the foot on your... No, 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 it wasn't she. That was a man. Okay. Mr. Fazil, good morning. Thank good, you for having good. me on my show so good. I can explain what is going on. You please, understand? Please. I have this my new series, Hold It Down, on TV6, right? Yeah. And we is filming, we is filming, we is filming, right? So, one day after we filming, just a freshen up, right? Yeah. I put on my powder, you know, with us powder, yeah, and we yeah, self yeah, yeah, yeah. This officer see me and tell me it's drugs I had on my chest, you understand? And I had was to tell him, it's not drugs, it's baby powder, you ain't know that, you understand? But he must, he must, he ain't have no girl now, you yeah. understand what I say? Okay. So he ain't know about them kind of thing, you understand? He grabbed me, threw me down on the floor, handcuffed me, you understand? And they carry me down. I had caught this morning, you know, you understand? But I make them take a DNA t test, a mm. DNA test to show it's baby powder and not drugs. But, but you tight with the Prime Minister, the Prime Minister call you and asking you to come and be the advisor. By yeah. the way, you are the advisor in the PM? No, I is not doing that because see, I, did, I had this job already, you understand? And I see what did happen to Dr. Fuad. I say me again catching that, you understand what I'm saying? But Prevention we, better than cure, you know? But, but, but if, if you get the blessing of the Prime Minister, you could do what you want in this country. Well, I don't want to do what I want. I want to obey the law. All we have is to obey the law. There's a the problem here, you know? You understand? We so accustomed doing what we want. Nobody does not want to obey the law. What happened there with, 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 with you, were, you, you, with, with you, you were you were robbed in, 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 in the Listen, I was running a little PH. We get set up. Well, you you're breaking the law already? No, because mm. Minister Jack said it was going on illegal. But you understand? Uh -huh. So I said, well, let me get taken from then. You understand what I said? So I tried to make a little extra dollar on a hustle. And this young fella, thank God I didn't take off all the rest of my jewelry. You know? This man tried to take the teeth out of my mouth, the teeth that my husband gave me for my anniversary. You understand? This anniversary He's still your husband? You know? Well, may I see him for a few years. I don't know whether he's alive or dead, you understand what I'm saying? Mm. But what are you going to do? You understand? So, but, so the program, when when the program going to be back on? Well, they say the 27th, you understand? But Mr. Fazir, this is a funny thing in this country, you understand? All that we like about I a Trini, I love Trini, Trinidad and Tobago, I a Trini Begodian, right? Mm. But when time for them to come to support local programming is a different story. So I want to tell the audience here, when you see my show, who advertising the show, you know them is a real trini, you understand, and care about local programming and building we up. If you don't see them in the show, well, you know, right? Well, you know, <laughs> but, but there's a serious thing, you know, because you're, you're here, oh, would it be local, we want to we want support yes, thing and you whatever. Yes, you understand? But, but we, yes, people Mouth struggling. Mouthpiece, 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 you understand what I'm saying? 
And, and we need it, we need to see ourselves, you understand what I'm saying? But people say, well, why want to see, I don't want to, I don't want to see fellow get lock up, I don't want to see fellow fighting in a taxi getting robbed, I don't want to see fellow, fellow taking well, on Well, you could sort of switch thing. the station, you understand, it has a plenty station now, you understand, switch the station. But we need local programming on the TV, you understand, how else is we going to build our identity? It's Auntie Kamala have a whole Office of Patriotism, she paying big salary to people to develop patriotism. Well, invest in local TV. You understand what I'm saying? Let me see myself. You, you think we really want to see ourselves, or we want to see all of them foreign people? And but people, the, you know what? Give them a Yankee accent. Give them a freshwater well, accent. Well, I tried that, but you see, I can't talk like that. You understand mm -hmm. what I'm saying? I can't talk like that. I don't know why we doesn't want to see. Well, no, we want to see ourselves. But we doesn't think we is a good investment. But you know why we doesn't think we is a good investment? Why? Let me tell you why. BWIA shares, International Trust Limited, NCB and Ocas Bank, yep. and now Clico. Anytime. Hey, you have money in Clico? You have mm -hmm. EFP? You have money first to put it in. I just have no money. I don't have that kind of money. But it have people who have no money who went and borrow and never pay back and all that kind of thing. You can well, join the yes, crowd? Yes, but that happened in government too. That has mm -hmm. happened right through. You understand? It's well, pirates. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Pirates of the Caribbean, but I want to tell all you something. You have to invest, believe in yourself. If we do not believe in yourself, who is going and believe in we? But that's the thing, you know, the, is everybody wants something for themselves, but no, don't everybody about... wants something for nothing. That is the first thing. Everybody feels they're entitled. Government money belong to whoever controlling it. This is wrong, you understand? The government, the oil, the gas, the pitch, everything belong to all of we. We just put your data manage, you understand? But you going about your legal business, powdering your neck and then and somebody put their boot on yeah, your neck. Yeah, because you see they have not educate the forces like they're supposed to, you understand? I feel that the poor police and regiment and them, they just get a raw deal. They need to be constantly educated, you understand? So that you could tell the difference. And now in this world, it have little kit like that. He could have just take a little Q-tip, just a thing, and know if it was drugs or not, you understand? But we behind the time. Mr. Fazir, does you know in this country, it have no computerized fingerprinting thing? It's CAD. They're about a one stack of cat that has go between St. James Police Station and CID. And then a man or two or a woman had to sit down and see if your fingerprint looking like that finger. Or in this day and age, Mr. Fazil. But you just still, I mean, I still can't understand how the police officer, even if he or she is stupid enough to not know who Philomena Alexis Batiste is. You mean nobody in the station didn't know who it was no, that was arrested? No, and they're tired from the state of emergency. But remember, under Uncle Patrick, a police did challenge he and the police suck some yes, all day, you understand what I say? A barrel you understand? So you can't tell you whether it's a celebrity. If I was a big fish, uh -huh. you understand? If the container with the chicken was mine, uh -huh. I good. So yeah. you know anybody who's a big fish that you could you could, no, you could go tight, get tight with? No, I will know big fish, you understand what I'm saying? I don't know and no big fish. And by the price of fish these days is But really anyway, like... I was going to court this morning to plead my case. Mm -hmm. You understand? Do you think you'll get off? Yes, because I make sure that they take the DNA test or the powder. Let me let me talk about something something different. Let me uh -huh. talk, talk about the, the, the little football and cricket. You see how, you see how the, the cricketers doing well, well in India? Well, listen to me. I love in that, you know. You mm. understand what I'm saying? You know, it, you know why it happened? The Indian and decide why they're doing good in India. Well, I'm glad, listen, me I care, you know. It could be Indian, African, Chinese, whatever. Mm. Once we're doing it, you understand? This country has it to be about who is best, not who looking best, if you mm. understand what I'm saying, you understand? Mm. So if it have more Indian than African, or it have more Chinese than Indian, whatever, mm. Once we win in our day, you understand what I say? And we have more to come next week, but... You does not find Trinidad cricket team does play better than West Indies. I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah you know yeah. why? So, why? Because West Indies cricket, just like all the government, all the country, mm. have too much political interference from man who never play cricket. That, is, that should be against the law if you never play cricket, or you could be on the, on the, co the selector's board. Like you want my work to talk about cricket? No, 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 no. I just really like cricket. I can't <laughs> see the ball when I go, you understand? Even when I put on my bifocal, I can't see the ball. What is this one in one thing that is we talking Can about? Can I hear on Mr. Ian program, the man say one is one, so I say, well, that's what you're supposed to say, me, you know. You understand why? What I, have, I, I, I think that's some gangster talk, talk or something. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. yeah you, you into the gangster talk. I, I don't understand it eh? when them any gangster fellas talking listen to me when i when that officer throw me down when that officer throw me down the on the floor day 
Well, no, I, I ain't want shit to tell him nothing. But when that officer told me down there, I think I get a mild concussion, you know. Mm. You understand? Know, I had a lawyer. You get a I lawyer. No, I defended myself. No, God. man, you have to get a lawyer. No, I ain't I get no lawyer. I need you for a lawyer to say, I defend Philomena Alexis Batiste against the, the, the heavy arm of the state. The man could get more, more, more Mr. clients. Mr. Fazil, I, did, I went by a lawyer, right? When my son went, he tell the lawyer, we ain't had no money, but we could bring some common fowl, egg, whatnot, provision. He say he ain't want that, he want cash. You understand? Know? I go defend myself, God is my witness, he knew I did not do nothing wrong, it was baby powder. But if you bring some Zabuka for him, I'm sure he would accept that, because uh, the price of Zabuka these days. I know, but you understand, I offer the man thing, what I had it, and he did not want that, he want cash. It wasn't a bribe you offered? No! Oh, I will offer a bribe, I just even know how to do that. I look at this, I want to bribe me. Can you say someone accept that, you know? Eh? Yeah. We, I know that. <laughs> Next thing, I is confused, you know? Has you realized everybody wearing bulletproof vests? Yeah. Who is not police? I know. Mr. Ian have one. I see a girl on a government program. She was in a camouflage bulletproof vest. Where is they getting that? You know, and I, I don't get one, I don't get one, because they said they, they, can't, they wouldn't waste the bullets on me. Well, I feel they want you to not have one. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, anyway, before time runs out, let me remind everybody. Yes. Once yes. you get off on the charge yes. and you get I, released. Listen, God is good. I am getting off this morning. I'm done visualizing it. You understand? Mm. Yeah. And I is getting off. You understand? Unless that magistrate rail by us. You understand? I is getting off. So, well, yeah, uh, wait, wait. I hope you ain't prejudiced the, 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 the court matter and that we don't get in trouble for, for, for making comments about, about the judge and the lawyer and so on. But you can get much more of that uh, with Philo on the rampage. Yes, Tuesday coming, the 27th. That is when it's starting. And I just want to tell all you, whoever you see advertising the show, that is who care about we. If you is not seeing them, you understand. Right. The views just expressed were not mine. We can have right. the news and then I'm coming back. All right. Powder in my chest is not drug, it's baby powder I put there to keep me cool and fresh. Oh God, all you, my show, my show go ahead and come back September 27, TV 6, 9 p.m. If I get out, I want you to run to TV 6. What is